I must mention two things. The main problem what we have is the anti-Gypsyism in our communities, in the, all, in the whole community in Europe. Anti-Gypsyism is a hundred of years old a form of, of racism and it's now it's the most tabooed form of racism. And that's a barrier for the equal participation. And in the past, everything for the national states, for the topic of Sinti of Sinti and Roman, the Romani people, was voluntary. And that's the point. When something voluntary, you have not the success. And the next point is when you're not involved the affected people from anti-Gypsyism in the conception of the solutions, then you have no success. And the other point was the most of these strategies and projects have no access to the people, to the affected people. And this was, was a big problem. And the, the approaches was paternalistic approaches. When we involved the affected people, the Romani people, in all levels of monitoring, in the projects, in everything, at the equal level, then I am very sure that we have then a success. And that is what my, my plan, my report will show, that we must change our strategy. And this uh, is a strategy that we want binding characters for the natural history. This is very, very, very important. Then the fight for anti-Gypsyism must be a priority. That's very important too. When you don't fight against uh, anti-Gypsyism, then inclusion strategies have no sin. And that shows the past. We are so different. We are so heterogeneous. But the majority and the policies don't see our, our heterogeneity. They say we are all homogene. And that's, that's the point, that we cannot take one recept for all. National states have different, different minorities from the Romani people. And that's the point that we must include these people that the national states include the people with so many background in this new strategy to have a success.